Welcome, my fellow followers of Chaos, back to the Third Age Divide and Conquer um, Dol Amroth campaign. Now, we're in a bit of a jam here. Um, we're being besieged by two forces. Uh, one's a very weak Haradrim force that we could probably defeat with just these units. Um, is this unit, say, 32? Okay, yeah, no problem. And these spearmen are pretty big, but... And then we have a pretty big uh, threat here with the Umbar. Uh, if they are to attack me next turn, that'd be ideal. We could actually defend our settlement then. Um, but we may be forced to act against them. Now, I have been getting some advice from you guys saying what I should do. Um, apparently, this is a place that gets attacked. Uh, I need to build another stack so I can actually fight or I'll be stuck in a war of attrition, which has already started. And uh, thank you all for, uh, well, thank you all who comment. Um, just keep at it. It really does help and gives me a nice pointer of where to go. Because, I mean, like, I've played this campaign before, but I didn't get this far playing it myself. Um, so anything past what I've already done is kind of uh, very new, very new to me. Now, the enemy faction leader is still here. Uh, his forces are basically no left with nothing. And uh, we could easily take him out right now. But um, I'm not sure if that may cause something where uh, someone else, someone will replace him. But uh, yeah. Also, I've received a comment about which settlement it was I should give away and I forgot again already um yeah i don't know if he meant ramland or maybe he meant i need to take over here i keep I keep forgetting i'm sorry but anyway um i guess we could go out to fight this guy uh we have a general here so yeah let's go fight him never shall they return Let's go destroy him. Yeah, let's do this. Here we go. What in the world? Okay. Good and ill have not changed since yesteryear. Aragorn, the riders of Rohan. Hmm. Here we go. Start deployment. What a nice map. Okay, do they have any archers? Not sure. We'll keep the uh put those guys up first. Are these pikemen actually yeah, they don't have a Oh they Okay. That's so funny. Okay, so they do have they do hold their formation, it's just they don't uh They're not as tightly together as uh, other units. Whatever. So what are we dealing with here? Whoa, big units. Biggest unit is their cavalry. They have some archers and uh, those javelinmen. Okay. No problem then. Well, let's, uh, let's just go get them. Let's go. We'll speed up. We'll speed up. Oh, they're just going to try to run away. Aw, oh, crap. Oh, no, they're not. They're holding their position up on the hill. Okay. Good. I've had enough of these buggers trying to run away. You know what? Let's take them out of formation. Let's get these guys running up. I'm sure our men will be tired, but um, I'm pretty sure in a fight like this, that's not crucial. We don't want to get our cavalry into archer range. That would not be ideal for us. Oh, what are these guys doing? The, br the brave champions of Harad, possibly? Okay. Oh, are they all going for it? Okay. Well, you guys... Uh, stop. Run... Get into formation. And this is where we'll hold. 
We'll get our militia on either side. Oh, their archers are starting to fire. We'll move them up to see if we could uh, get into range. Doesn't seem so. Oh yeah, well, whatever. Let's uh, let's start moving our pikemen here. And then, yeah, we'll just advance like this. Get our cavalry going behind. So now our pikemen will advance towards the enemy general, uh, slaying whoever gets in their path. Or we should probably run those militia that are down there, so that they can actually get into position. Oh, look at these! Look at these spearmen. So brave to fight my clearly superior farmhand pikemen. Okay, fine. Kill them. Oh, they're going for it. Okay, let's go charge into them. Apparently their general thinks it's a good idea to charge into pikemen. I'm not going to complain. Excellent. Yeah, here we go. Nice charge on their archers. And yeah, they didn't like that. Awesome. Now they're probably going to charge a, uh, try to charge my general, but um Oh, that actually didn't. They're just now being shaken by that. Wow. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Excellent. Oh, go after those tribesmen. Hey guys, that's only one guy. That unit's not going to survive. Catch them. There we go. They're dropping. Okay. I think we can speed this up. There we go. We killed all of them. Charge into their general... Oh, they actually managed to get all the way to the back. Okay, there's only a handful of them left now. Oh, there's their general right there. Kill them. Not just the general, the faction leader. Excuse me. Yeah, we don't need to watch this. Let's just speed it up. He's a tough one. There we go. Let the crows have his miserable bones, and let our swords have his men. That's more than just a general. That's their. That's their we leader, man. The victory we have won here today. Awesome. Lost a few more men than we probably should have, but meh, whatever. Now this force is free to uh to join the rest of us in uh in Harad. Oh, that's a nice picture of the Urukai there. That's a very cool picture, actually. I like this helmet. Honestly, I was looking at playing as Isengard, but oh my god, are they being played as a lot recently. If I wasn't going to do... If I was ever to do a um, an evil campaign, it'd probably be Isengard. Oh, there we go. That was a little laggy. That was weird. Faction destroyed. Oh, what? Okay. Oh, wow. So approaching quietly. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome. Okay, so they're wow. I probably should have done that a long time ago. Well. <laughs> okay, I really didn't expect that. Maintain order. Awesome. So Harad is no longer a faction cuz we we killed their faction leader that I should have killed a long time ago because he was just uh, chilling on my island. I don't know why I get really low frames here. That was weird. Um, okay, yeah, let's end the turn and see if uh, they attack us. Wow, I really didn't expect that. I wonder will that change um, how Harad is script scripted? Maybe I won't be attacked so much because rebels, like, they're hardly ever aggressive. Wow. That's awesome. Why didn't anybody tell me that? Oh, here they go. They're attacking us. So they just got a bunch of pikemen. 
Um, I think we can hold it pretty well. I'm pretty sure this force is much better than the one we defended this place with before. So, whatever. Let's get in here. I st still can't believe her rod got wiped out because we killed her faction leader. That's hilarious. Hopefully that'll take them off my back for a while. Talking about the dwarfs. Okay, let's start deployment. So they're all coming from the front. Oh, this place definitely isn't converted. Look at all these eastern buildings. Uh, so they have three rams. Uh, well, one. They're only uh, they're only using one. So they're going to be coming through this gate. Awesome. Let's uh, let's do the classic. Oh, maybe it, oh, it won't work because this place is uh, too small. Okay. Man, that's the best defense ever when you just have two pike units and a V. Many a battle was won in Rome 1 with that tactic. My goodness, I can't get anybody here. Come on. Okay, is it because all these people are here? Get out of here. Could be. Yeah, okay. I mean, we still can't put them exactly the way that I would have wanted to, but uh, I guess this will have to do. Can we get a uh, double stacking going on here? Maybe. I'm not really sure if that's even a good idea in this game, but eh, whatever. Uh, then we get some archers down here. Put our skirmishers over here, I guess. Uh, Haven guard. Whatever. Whatever. Actually, we shouldn't group up units because they'll be shot at pretty easily then. And then I guess the other thing we'll do is we'll just make our cavalry run out this side. So we get everybody lined up. Come on. Oh, I don't think that's everybody. No, it certainly isn't. Okay. We got a unit of 73 over here. There we go. That's everybody. Yep, there we go. And I guess that's everybody over there. Yep. Okay, let's start this. Well, there goes our towers firing already. Uh, we'll definitely use flaming shot. Now, these Belagar footmen, they're, uh, they seem to be the elite here. So, um, be nice if we could kill a bunch of them. We'll definitely get our guys targeting that. Now, would I be able to move this unit up? Oh, excellent, I can. We'll definitely do that. Get them as close to the gate as possible. Now we're killing a few of them. Oh, I should have been getting my cavalry out. That was dumb. I put them there for that reason. I wasn't even taking them out. Right, look at all these light infantry. Excellent. Other than those pikes, obviously, we can't charge them. Okay, the enemy are at our gates. Yeah, they sure are. Okay, they can't. They can't uh, throw their javelins from there. Enemy are battering down our gates. Oh. Oh, hello, archers. Well, you're not going to enjoy what's about to happen to you. They, they come around the corner and they're just like, oh, crap. Oh, they're going to try to shoot. But, uh, yeah, that's not going to work. I'm sorry. Oh, maybe it did work. Oh, wow. That was actually bad. Oh, yeah, they're trying to they're trying to run away. It's not going to work. Oh, hello, camel archers. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. The enemy's ram has breached the gates. That's no problem. They're going to run into a bunch of pikes. So, it's going to take them a long time to get through those defenses. Okay, we're killing these archers. They're wavering. If we could break them, that'd be pretty nice. Everyone's just rushing for the gate now. Oh, come on. Go get them. Don't just, don't just break off. Good yeah, everybody. The enemy oh. General lies dead. Okay. The enemy general was on those camels, apparently. Well, that's going to help us a lot. Awesome. 
Well, now everybody's just going to run in, get impaled on our pikes. Oh, don't know why you guys are doing that. Don't know why you guys are doing that. Get out of there. Oh, my God. Don't know why you're doing that. Oh, I didn't put on... Oh, I didn't even think about that. Oops. Run! Well, that's not what I expected to happen. Also, no. Don't want to attack. Oh, okay. Well, you're killing a few of those guys. That's cool. Damn. We lost a bunch of those pikemen that we shouldn't have. Okay, we broke those camel archers. That's good. Lost a bunch of those pikemen that we didn't need to. And we're still losing them because they're they rushed out of the gate for some reason. Well, we'll just have to deal with that, I guess. That's all pikemen. Is there anything else we can deal with? Well, we can kill them, the rest of those raiders so they don't come back. That'd be nice. Come on, guys. Okay, we'll just make your phalanx. Um, well, I'm getting some serious frame issues here. Whoa. Okay. Well, we'll send in the Haven Guard and the Gondor Militia. Um, we will we just, did we just kill all of them? Yep. Awesome. Uh, those raiders are running away. We'll definitely come charge into them. Apparently those savages are counted as a Nah, we're fine. We killed 32%. That's good. Did it say spearmen? Oh, sav savages, I guess. Wow, so laggy. I know it's not a good idea to charge a unit with multiple units of cavalry in this game. It doesn't really work. But, eh, whatever. Wow, they're carving through our pikemen. That's not what I wanted. Or really, what I planned on, ha on happening. Okay, we're starting to lose a bit of cavalry back off. We'll start doing selective charges after this. Instead of just general into everything. Oh, they brought out their pikemen too anyway. So, yeah, makes sense that we left. Run away. We've lost 10%. We've killed 40. That's pretty good. Could they fire at these guys? No. Okay. That's fine. We'll turn off flaming arrows. I don't know if that's really a good idea or not, but that will do it anyway. Oh, those pikemen are broken. Definitely. Go chase them down. We do not want them to come back. They're trapped in a bit of a crush here now, honestly. Because a bunch of their units are trying to leave the... Uh, I can attack that? Okay. A bunch of their units are trying to actually run away. While the other ones are trying to go in. Wow, look at those guys. Oh, uh, please excuse the horrible frames that I'm having right now. That's weird. Kill them. Oh, why are you going that way? Those are some cool looking units for, uh, for Umbar there. Okay, we have them in a huge, in a huge, uh, pincer here now. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, that's, okay. I thought that was them attacking a unit. These damn pikemen are still marching around everywhere. Where are they going? Like, the the enemy are right there that I'm telling you to attack. Go kill them. Let's see if walking, if going through them. There we go, yeah, kill them. Kill them. Oh, hello. Okay, how's it going over here? Oh, everybody's... A bunch of units are trying to leave. Okay. Oh, 
fuck's sakes. Everyone's trying to rush out again and they're getting destroyed. Corsair Warriors, Spearmen. You are not Spearmen. You have swords. Don't try to trick me. Why are you guys just standing still? I tell them. Oh, wait, no, I was telling them to move. Never mind. Okay, let's do that. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Yeah, I was going to ask if we killed some of these guys, but we uh, we certainly did. They don't want to waver, though. See if I can just get a little charge in here. Pull these guys out of the way. Charge in with these guys. Let's get a good charge in on those guys over there. Oh, they're wavering. Come on, break. Break. That'd be really nice. No, they're not going to break. Not with another unit there next to them. Okay, well, those guys, we'll just let them go. Let's just get back to the fight with these Cav. Oh, hello. Oh, we'll get another, get another charge on these Corsair Warriors. That'd be nice. Oh, we're going to get our lances down? Excellent. The battle is very much in our favor. There we go. Victory will be ours. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Hell yeah. I mean, we've lost a quarter because our men charged out of the gates, which I didn't plan on happening, but... Oops. Okay, let's just save our pikemen. I mean, we should probably save the, sa the Haven Guard, obviously, because... Oh, I had another unit of pikemen that I didn't even know about. Oh, great. Awesome. Well, we'll get them into position, and we'll back off, because we're losing way too many men doing this. Um, there's still pikemen everywhere. Okay, let's get a cheeky charge in. See if we can break some morale here. Oh. Someone's charging. Oh, hello. Goodness, guys. Yeah, that wasn't a good charge. Get out of there. I hate how they just keep their pikemen out of the fight. It's smart, but I hate it. Okay, let's see if I can get some good flanking here. Get a charge in there. And we get our lancers moving around. Not into the pikemen. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Yes, I know. Well, keep it moving forward. Come on. Or, you know, you could die to that one pike man. Charge, come on. What are you doing? Oh my god. Go away. Goddamn pikeman. This happened last time, too. So fucking annoying. Good God. They just left their pikemen out the whole time. Okay, here we go. We're making them run away. Except for... Can you guess? The fucking pikemen. I don't even care. Just charge them. Got your lances down even though you weren't moving at all. Awesome. Come on, just break. There we go. I think that's everybody now. It should be. Oh, no. That unit of pikemen. Okay. Well, we broke everybody else, so. Let's see if we can get everybody out here. 
So we can do some fancy work on these pikemen. Oh, hello. Just chill out here, whatever. No, don't. No. Oh, okay. There we go. Come on. Yeah, that's what I want to do, but I'm not sure if we're going to catch everybody. Wow, we lost a lot of Lancers. We had like 58 or 50-something 50 of them. Yeah, we'll just chase after them. Really want to take down this big unit of pikemen for how annoying they were. There we go. They'll get what they deserve. Oh, wow. Just carving through them. Good. That's what I want. Oh. Uh, we'll kill it. There we go. Excellent. Heroic, apparently. Let all her wouldn't really call that <laughs> heroic, but whatever. Oh, that's another picture from uh, War in the North, I believe. Kill Gorgon, kill Orc folk, kill... No other words, please, Wild Men. Uh, will you pay for it? No. Not surprising. So, that entire army was wiped out. Gift available. Or guild, what am I saying? Royal Swordsmiths Guild. For 1,000. Yeah, whatever, let's do it. North Athelian attack. It's happened a few times. Gobel and Kilimon. Hmm. Where, where the hell am I? Come on. There we go. Oh, they're actually not besieging me anymore. I will not waste words on you. That's good. So let's see. Still can't recruit anything. Not surprising. Uh, our population isn't that high, so that might be why. I think we have buildings. Yeah, we have plenty of buildings. Twenty five percent due to Dane. How do I see my religion? Ah, here we go. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah, that's definitely why. I can't I guess there's no Ah. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Uh what's twelve percent. Yeah, that makes sense. Now I understand why. Yeah, our, ours is the majority here. That's why we can recruit. Oh, we can actually recruit a nice bit, a nice bit of stuff here. Oh, we'll definitely do that. Uh, is there more for infantry units? No? Okay, let's get stables then. Oh, wow, I didn't even really notice that. Well, we'll definitely get some more units then. Uh, what can we retrain? Oh, well, we'll do that. Cool. So now these guys are free as well. So, um... Uh, Oh, hello. Random Leave navies. Me Leave me be. Could we uh, get rid of these guys? And the and oh, excellent. Wow. Destroyed them. Okay, so we're going to get these guys on the ship. We oh, we can't move. There. Well, hopefully we nothing attacks them. Uh, can we raise any forces here? Yeah, like another unit of archers, but we already have like, what, like three or four? Three. So that's not really a big deal. Uh, can we recruit anything else here? Oh, we can recruit more units. Uh, what are we making? We're losing money right now. I think that might be because of us buying stuff. So I'll wait. I'll wait. And yeah, I really need to take the fight to, uh, to Umbar. Approaching. Oh, hello. Approaching quietly. So there's Umbar itself. I think that's the closest settlement to us. So, uh, yeah. Oh, we can actually retrain everything here. Excellent. Okay, what do we want to retrain? Oh, uh, well, actually, you know what? Just to make it easy, we'll merge a little bit. Okay, that's as much as we can do, apparently. 
Uh, I don't need to retrain those. Go away. Let's see. Who do we really want? Yeah, let's retrain these guys. That'd be the most important. And those. We'll retrain everybody, but uh, these will take the priority for now. Uh, it'll only take one turn. Awesome. I will not waste words now, these guys are still be here being assholes. But, uh, yeah. We have reached the 30 minute mark, so I believe that is where we're going to end the episode. Uh, I didn't get much accomplished, but uh, we cleared that Umbar army, so now I'm going to get some forces down here as quickly as I can. And we're going to take the offensive, and uh, hopefully we can wipe them out, because that would mean victory in this campaign, because that's all we need to do is wipe out the Umbar and own a certain amount of settlements. 25. We own 8. So, yeah, we just need to eliminate the Umbar, so just go down this coast and maybe take a little bit more over here from the rebels that <laughs> just spontaneously appeared out of nowhere. But uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this episode, please be sure to leave a like and a comment like always. If you enjoy this series, be sure to subscribe and tell me how much you enjoy it, all that good stuff. And yeah, this has been Overkill as always, guys, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.